All right, guys, so today I do have a really quick one for you. It's gonna be the 11 most popular AI-related courses in 2024. And this is one that a lot of people requested because a lot of people are interested in getting into AI. They've seen how amazing ChatGPT is. They've seen all of the amazing applications and use cases of AI. Honestly, I was a big fan of AI, but even I was impressed with everything they've been able to do with it so far. And I see some stuff coming down the line that's gonna be absolutely mind-blowing. And we're gonna get started with it right after you gently boop the like button. All right, so the first one on the list is prompt engineering for chat GPT, and this is gonna be on Coursera. So this one takes about 18 hours approximately to go through. Coursera, I'm a huge fan of them. They have a bunch of amazing courses on there. And this is basically where you get your prompt engineering specialization. So it's basically a shareable career certificate that you can put on your LinkedIn profile or even on your resume. And this can definitely help you to either start doing this as a side hustle, get freelancing jobs, or even get your own job as well. And AI engineers are making about $125 to $193,000 a year. Additionally, there's ways of using AI to start different types of businesses. There's a lot of different AI automation agencies, for instance, and they'll basically go into businesses and see how they can use AI to streamline and automate their operations. Has a lot of great reviews on Reddit and other different websites, so definitely check it out. Quick pause to share a really good deal with you thanks to our sponsor, Coursera. There's a deal for the Coursera Plus monthly subscription until August 9th. You get 50% off the first month of Coursera Plus. You have unlimited access to over 7,000 courses. And these are from top universities and companies such as Google, IBM, and Meta. You can explore careers in cybersecurity, data analytics, business analytics, user experience, and more. And you will earn unlimited certificates at no extra cost. So join the rest of the learners who report personal benefits like boosted confidence and a sense of accomplishment. Don't miss out on this limited time offer. Sign up with Coursera Plus monthly today. Links in the description in the pinned comment below. Next on the list is going to be Introduction to Generative AI, which is a Google Cloud Skills Boost. So you can find this on cloudskillboost.google and you can finish this in a matter of hours or days. And this is another really good one you could put on your resume, your portfolio, your LinkedIn, etc. And plus it's gonna teach you valuable skills and get you started with generative AI. So yeah, lots of great jobs you can get that are related to this. For instance, AI research scientists make 109 dollars to $163,000 a year. I know what a lot of people are thinking, oh, there's no way just get Getting this certificate is going to get me a job and you're probably right right so if you're already working in the tech industry for instance and then you get certificates like this it's probably going to be much easier to get a job but if you have zero experience you're going to have to not only get certificates like this but you're also going to have to create a great portfolio and you're going to have to be able to prove that you know the skills right you actually have the skills that you're saying that you have next is going to be the machine learning specialization and this you can find on coursera and by the way i'm going to have links to all of these down in the description as well as the pinned comment below you can check out all of the different courses. But yeah, this course is actually done by Andrew Ng, which I'm, I apologize if I'm saying his name wrong, but he is basically a freaking goat and a legend in the AI slash machine learning uh, slash generative AI and all that kind of thing. Now this certificate takes approximately 33 hours to complete. They do say it's beginner level, but to be honest with you, uh, press F for doubt because this is pretty complicated stuff and you probably are gonna have to have a little bit of a coding background to understand this and get a lot out of it. I mean, I guess you technically could do it as a beginner. You just have to take much, much longer than someone who has some basic coding skills. And yeah, you get a certificate that you can put on your resume, on your LinkedIn, on your portfolio, etc. It does look really good. And there's a bunch of people that have covered the machine learning specialization and they've talked about it on YouTube. And there's a lot of people who talk about how you can get into these types of jobs on YouTube. All right, next one is very similar. It was actually put out by the same exact person and that's the deep learning specialization. This is also on Coursera. And Andrew Ng is one of the top instructors as well as several others. And by the way, guys, um, on Coursera, you can basically try it out for seven days completely free. After that, it's $49 a month, which is extremely affordable considering the value that you get from these courses. But yeah, you can definitely try it out for free for seven days and see if you like it. And yeah, the deep learning specialization is also really good. Uh, you probably wanna take this after you take the machine learning specialization, but this one has 127,000 ratings and a 4.9 star rating. So these courses are excellent. So definitely check that out. Even machine learning interns make 86 to $127,000 a year. So if you can master this stuff, if you can get good at machine learning and even just get an internship, you're probably gonna be making pretty 
close to six figures a year. By the way, comment down below if you like some of these certificates, maybe you don't like them, maybe you've taken them, you wanna give us your experience, whether it's good or bad, and also comment down below if there's a certificate that you think I should have included on this list. Next is going to be the Generative AI with Large Language Models course that is hosted on Coursera. This one takes approximately 16 hours to complete. You also will get a really impressive certificate. Uh, it's really good stuff, more generative AI stuff, and some companies will value some certificates over others, so it's always a good idea to get this one as well. Next is going to be the IBM Data Science Certificate. Now, I know this isn't technically AI related, it's data science related, but there is a lot of overlap between those two things. Now, this one does take a little bit longer. They say it takes about five months if you study 10 hours a week, but most of the self-reporting shows that it takes more like one to two months. This one is also hosted on Coursera. There's a lot of different instructors in this one, so they have a wide range of extremely talented professionals that are teaching this. You can also get into different data science related careers, which are very, very high paying. And by the way, any of these careers that they show on Coursera, the reason they're on Coursera, the reason these companies go through so much effort to put their courses on Coursera is because they found that they don't have enough people that have these skills. And that's why they're literally telling you the skills that they're looking for, right? So this is kind of like the hint of the century to learn these types of things because there's not enough people out there that have these skills and that's why they're making the courses. Next is gonna be the AI for Everyone course. This is by deeplearning.ai and it's also hosted on Coursera. So absolutely love this one, phenomenal course. This is more practical applications that just everyday normal people can use whether you have any coding knowledge at all or whether you have a little bit of coding knowledge, this is gonna be super useful for you. So they say that this one takes about three weeks if you study two hours a week. So it takes about six hours to complete. And there's already over 1.2 million people that have gone through this course. And this one also has Andrew Ng as an instructor and it has a 4.8 star rating. So there's several different modules within this. Uh, the first one is what is AI? Pretty good module. Second one is building AI projects. Third one is building AI in your company. So if you own a company, this can be very useful or if you work in a company, it can be useful. And then the fourth one is AI for society, which kind of just shows some different use cases or hypothetical use cases of AI in society. Now this one probably isn't gonna get you a job on its own, but just the fact that you have the certification is gonna look really good no matter what job you're in. For instance, if you're a project manager, this would look great. If you're an operations manager, this would look great. Just about any job you're in, whether whether it's data analytics, product manager, even sales, this would look really good on your resume, LinkedIn, or portfolio. So yeah, definitely a good one to look into. And by the way, share this video with a friend who needs to see it if you're really enjoying it. We really wanna get these great resources such as Coursera out there for the whole world to see. So definitely share this video. You know, I don't have a big marketing department or anything like that. I don't spend millions of dollars a year on marketing. So I kind of just rely on word of mouth. So I really appreciate it if you share this with a friend who you think could benefit from it. Next is going to be the supervised machine machine learning certificate, and this is also by deeplearning.ai, and it focuses on regression and classification, and it is hosted on Coursera as well. So this one takes about 33 hours to get through. It has a 4.9 star rating. It does say that it's beginner level, although I do doubt that just a little bit. It also has Andrew Ng as an instructor, and yeah, lots of different jobs this could help you land, especially if you already have some experience in tech. For instance, machine learning research assistants make $106,000 to $149,000 a year. And by the way, all of these certificates I'm mentioning have stellar reviews online. That's why I included them in the video. So yeah, really good one. Um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it already and you're just lurking. Come on, what are you waiting for? Definitely subscribe to the channel. We put out the best content on how to make more money and how to secure your financial future. Next is going to be the IBM Applied AI Professional Certificate. So this one isn't quite as popular, but it's also really good. It is put out by the company IBM and it is hosted on Coursera. This one takes about three months, they say, at 10 hours a week. And typically that means it's probably gonna take way less than a month in order to complete it realistically. It is a seven course series and overall it has really good ratings online. Definitely worth checking out. Next is the AI product management specialization. So this one is specifically for product managers and it was put out by Duke University and it's hosted on Coursera. So yeah, this is a really good one. They say it takes about four months at five hours a week, almost always with the Coursera certificates. Um, it takes 
way less time than what they put on the website. So realistically, it probably takes less than a month. Also a really good one, definitely check it out. And the next is the IBM AI Engineering Professional Certificate. So this is another one that doesn't get as much love because it's IBM and for some reason they don't get as many views as some of the other companies online. It is also hosted on Coursera. They say it takes two months at 10 hours a week, so it probably takes well under a month in reality. It is a six course series. And I would definitely check out the courses and see if there's something in those courses that you'd like to learn. For instance, they have a course on TensorFlow, they have one on PyTorch, they have one on computer vision and image processing. So depending on what you want to do with AI, definitely check out the individual courses to see if this is something you want to spend your time learning. And yeah, this one has really good ratings online. There's jobs you can get into that this would help you get into like AI engineer that make $125,000 to $194,000 a year. Overall, really good stuff. By the way, I did do a video on the Google certificate tier list that goes over all of the best Google certificates that are hosted on Coursera. And these are Google certificates that help people get jobs from absolute zero, right? So these are some of the best ones in the game. They have hundreds, if not thousands of amazing reviews. And you can check that video out by clicking right here.